Hey everybody, it's me, Wildman Beats here, and this is gonna be episode 11 of Assassin's Creed Rogue. And last episode, we went into the uh, Riverlands to help get uh, Colonel Colonel Morgan out of trouble. He was almost getting killed by Kasegawase and the assassins, but we managed to get him to safety. And with that, he has told us that any debt that we ever owed, oh, not not Colonel Morgan, Colonel Monroe, his name's Monroe, um, that any debt we owe the assassins is since removed, that Shay has no debt, or no debt to the Templars anymore, but it seems his loyalties have aligned with them now, so it doesn't matter what debt he owes, he will stick with them, we'll see where we go next, so anyway, thank you for coming to watch this video, I hope you enjoy, and otherwise, let's get into it. All right, let's get on our ship. Let's see. Fire! Watch your course, Captain. Two rounds. Two rounds. Fire! That's Ready so fire, much Captain. cannon fire. Fire! Wow. I missed? Really? Oh, I thought I hit them. Idiot. Um, do I take a right here? Probably not. Just go straight. It's raining. I forget though, like River Valley is uh, pretty small, so not having to fast travel, not being able to, isn't really that big of an issue. Let's stop here so we do get this marked down as a uh, fast travel point though. I think that wasn't docking. I just have to go out, touch the dock, and it's like, oh wow, now you know the place. Cool, cool, cool. And then we leave. Captain's helm! Get the maid says it to the wind! And oh interesting. There's a beached ship here. No cannons on the side though. Not even really any. That ship looks lame. It doesn't have any cannons. Wasn't designed for them even. Let's stop here so this gets marked as a fast travel point. Clip ahead, sir. Clues up. Jesus deck. Why didn't it have a docking place though? So? Oh. Okay. Fire! Is that a sea fort? Oh. See, if I went up here, I would have avoided that, but I think Get that C4 speed. is going to target me as an enemy. So this is kind of their way of like doing a ship upgrades check on you. Because to get to the next mission, you have to take out a fort. Fire! Fire! 
siege. Someone's shooting us from behind. Loose and cuts the wind. Let's uh get into port. We'll be crushed captain. Hooray! On your mark, Captain! All in the stunts! Get in there! Ready! Sacks got them! Alright. Time to invade the fort. I'm seeing our point of entry. Pretty obvious. Sorry, buddy. Eight seconds. Gotta run. Now what? Oh, that's it. It's over. Port's ours. I thought I'd have to find the war room or whatever. But I guess that's only because the other one had Le Chasseur in it. Sixteen hundred income. I wonder how much I have. Let's get this chest over here too. Yeah. Keep the port strong, boys. Interesting that we're killing all the people that were at, on the side of all the people that we killed in both AC3 and 4. Yeah! Oh, that's our team now. Okay, and here's our mission. Why did it slow me down? Did I come too close to the, to the ground? Maybe. It's kind of picky about that. All right, let's dock. Yeah. Old growth forest. Okay. 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Game devs? If there's any game devs watching this, you suck. What is this? This is just not forgivable. What the fuck is this? This grass. You have a job, game devs, and I hope this is not it. Because this sucks. Imagine you're a game dev and someone's like, oh, you know how to put grass in a game? And they're like, no, that's hard. They shouldn't be a game dev. It's the wrong career for them. If they don't know how to do grass, man, they don't deserve to eat. Now I'm just looking around seeing if there's any more shitty grass. Okay, let's see. So, Colonel, it seems my life has an open book to you. Men from my regiment found you delirious and half drowned. I did not know who you were. But what you were was obvious. My blades. I brought you to the Finnegans for care. Their late son was one of our order. Master Johnson was furious. It was a risk. But I suspected you might have left your brothers behind. Colonel. The manuscript. Why return it to me? Because, Master Cormac, you earned my trust. It could not be in better hands. Respectfully, wow. sir. I'm more of a target than you now. Gentlemen, Kisigawase is rallying to storm Albany. His allies threaten a friendly Oneida village, and French troops have already entered our territory. Might be able to delay the French and help the Oneida. We will ready the defenses in Albany. If we are so to we gave the Kisigawase manuscript back. And his allies, I need to help the Oneida and see what I can do about the French. Okay. That's pretty interesting though that he gave the manuscript back to him That's like the most valuable thing in the world Johnson stockpiled powder and shot here Bless him So William Johnson was really mad at Monroe for letting me live Especially I guess for taking me in to pry, but would you happen to know if Kesegawase has any weaknesses? He hasn't any. He was a scum. Let's see. Oh, right here. And mercenary long before he joined the assassins. May Lady Luck be with you, then. I make my own luck. The Colonel exerts a certain amount of control over the army, or part of it anyway. But we'll need both the soldiers and their native allies if we're to set up a proper defense against Kesegawase. Kesegawase has allies in every tribe that sided with the French, as well as many others. Trappers, hunters, scouts. We'll need all the help we can muster. All right, well, let's go get some of that help. <laughs> Oh, a dead native. But they add euros? Interesting. Whoa, you can do one of these with that? I didn't even know. How do I get up? Ah, I gotta climb these rocks. I think I see. Gotta go over to the vines. Camera was lagging behind.
Dang. I gotta be careful. What's in the cave? Halt! I like how you scream and halt and this guy doesn't even hear him. Will that one turn around? He does. Stay alert, men. What? I just counter. No. Not the grenade. Oh, I thought it might kill them. Oh, why did I do this? That was an accident. Oh, oh, oh my god. How do I get into that? Thank you. I mean it, sir. Now it gets a little bit harder. to kill the gunner and free them and they can actually kill the others wow let's get this viewpoint no casualties so far and i only need one more it's pretty good Let's see here. There we go. And who is she? Venerable one. My name is Shay Patrick Cormick. I... I am a friend. A friend indeed. You have the gratitude of my people, Shay Patrick Cormick. For as long as you shall walk this earth, you will have a place here among us. My thanks. It is I who thank you, young man. Would you be so kind as to walk with me? Okay. She seems nice. I am called Onata. There is a legend among my people. It tells of how the land under our feet was born and how good and evil came into this world. The Sky Woman scattered her wisdom throughout our land. If you follow her path, you shall learn the true history of our people, and perhaps even uncover the reward locked within this cave. If and how do I get hero, that? I believe you to be. You honor me, venerable one. It is you who honor us, Shay Patrick Cormac. Farewell. Oh. Native pillar. 
there's four of them only four one two three four okay seven seven does this game know how to count hello <laughs> Why can't I fast travel here? Whatever. It's a little bit of a run, but we'll make the run. Oh, I see. I don't only have the green flag. Saw the Morgan off in the distance. It's got a green flag on the main mast, but a English one. On the side, uh, on the second. Whoa. They have a special animation for jumping down there. That's kind of cool. Just go across, find the British Army, which uh, there's fire there. Oh, we go here. That's not a cliff, that's a dock. That's where we're going. Oh, jeez. A little bit of a crash. Uh, hey, I can get a renovation over here If I have the metal I might not have metal for it Doesn't need metal perfect A fishing hut cool Now we got fish income Climb up here. Yeah. Is there something else scuttling up this tree? I thought I saw a little critter. I guess it doesn't matter though. There's some nice wilderness here. Just a peaceful run through the trees. And what do we have here? Help the British. Are they in trouble? Can't really tell. Oh, they are. Damn. That was an execution sequence. That is all this new world has brought. Cut down the. Oh, anonymous? Really? Oh, come on. It's not letting me counter. Where'd that dude go? Okay, flag down. We have to kill the captain, though. You know what I can use right now? A bottle of fire. You can't mess with that. It won't let me counter again. This game is dumb. Uncounterable attacks. Cool. Oh boy. Well, that mission's done. We vanquished those French dogs. 
5,800 money in the bank? We vanquish those French dogs. Bank is full. Tonight, oh, that's not good. Whoa, where does this want us to go? Way, way back. Um, let's just go here for now. I just want to go in the ship. Because it's got that thing, right? What, what was that? Just go on the ground, you fucking idiot. Oh, I didn't... I want... Oh, my God. Why does it just automatically resort to... I'm going to climb on the railings instead of running on the ground. <laughs> Jeez. Um. All right. Got my money. Five thou. And... I think that is where we're gonna leave it for episode 11 of Assassin's Creed Rogue. So, anyway, thank you for subscribing and hitting that bell button. And as always, have a great day.